There you go, sir. Thank you. Hi, folks. Larry Ladowski with Midwest Outdoors. Today, I'm up in central Wisconsin. We're fishing Lake Petenwell, and I'm fishing with Darren Kerrigan and his dad, Larry, of First Strike Fishing. I'm also along here with KC Knopf, and we're going to try and coax some perch into biting today. We're setting up uh, the first First Strike rig here. Larry's setting up over there. Casey's setting up over here. And we're gonna see if we can get some action. We try to set up before daylight comes so that we all of our disturbances are happening before the, the light breaks so that when it settles down for a good half hour before we actually start to fish. So now it's just a waiting period for about 15 minutes to see if and get some strikes. Huh? Exactly. Right on. We're, we're uh, encountering prime time, Larry, so <laughs> let's get ready. It just took a little more. A little bit. Oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. Big. It's there. Good timing. It's there. <laughs> nice one? Oh, yeah. It's nice. Again, I don't think it's a perch. <laughs> oh, it is a perch. Oh, man. Maybe they are perch. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, wow. <laughs> nice job. Holy cow. See, it's old. Oh, what a pig! Talk about a jumbo. Yeah, no kidding. So what's the structure we're fishing for today, guys? We're fishing a flat off the main lake that there's one trough that I found that these fish kind of push bait up and they utilize and they kind of run this trough that runs this way. So we're kind of set up parallel with the trough and we're going to hopefully catch a few perch today and catch a few walleyes as well. Oh, two of them, two of them. I'm gonna let them eat it, Larry. Yeah, I'm gonna do that here too. We got two flags up right now. Casey's got that one back there and this one just triggered too at the same time. Kind of just sitting there waiting. Don't know if it just took it and stopped or if it got something on it. Got him. Nice. Yeah. yeah. There he's coming. Oh, it's a walleye. Oh, it's a walleye. <laughs> Woo. Okay, we got one here. Oh, I did. Inhaled it all the way down. Man, they're eating good. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Good keeper walleye. Let's go see what Casey's got over there real quick. Yeah. Stuck on the ice. There you go. It's big perch. Jumbo. Oh, nice. Perch. nice. Beautiful. Nice jumbo. Yeah, they're a beautiful color in this lake, huh? I don't know. We just had a flurry of activity, but these fish are just moving through and they're grabbing the minnows and they're they're basically just hitting it and running too. So we're having a tough time keeping them on the hooks. <laughs> hey look, you can see his his fins are already freezing. <laughs> it's a little yeah, chilly. It's, it's, it's chilly out here. <laughs> We just caught this fish and his gill plates are already frozen and the back fin is just frozen solid straight up. It's cold out here. <laughs> so we noticed we had a lot of action on this side so we're gonna kind of keep working our way this way. We just drilled this hole. It's, uh, it's actually pretty cold out here so it's nice that me and Larry are able to knock this out together. It's a good, good idea to fish with a buddy. Makes things go a lot easier. You could tell too that you could see our spread. And we're trying to keep it a little bit compact today just because of the cold. We don't want to be running all over the place, but inevitably, I mean, as soon as this one goes off, there's going to be one on the other end that goes off too. <laughs> Folks, this is Darren Carrington. He's the owner of First Strike Fishing. Darren, by now a lot of our viewers have seen the First Strike, but give us a little overview of what it is all about. Okay, we manufacture the First Strike Bite Indicator. Um, you can get these by yourself. You can use them on your river rods in the summertime, pull them off in the winter, throw them on your ice rods. What it does is just attach to your rod, so you can get the range you would get out of a tip up using a rod and reel. We also uh, put together a combination kit with an ice rod. It comes with the Akuma Bait Feeder Reel. Um, the first strike bite indicator and the stand. And you make a couple of different models with these. We do. We have a lighted indicator too for night fishing. 
works great and we got the standard indicator. We also have a, a larger ice rod stand for the bigger rods. And the nice thing about the entire units or the entire systems that they sell here, you can catch anything from panfish with what we're doing today all the way up to pike and really anything. Absolutely, we're perch fishing with the walleye combo here today. Um, we've been up do a lot of Lake of the Woods fishing for giant pike uh, with nine inch suckers on these using the same indicator so you can set the sensitivity as light or heavy as you need for the pike. That's awesome. You can check them out at firststrikefishing.com. Well, Darren, this guy's a little frozen. I'm a little chilly, too. Absolutely. <laughs> I say we head back in and warm up a little bit, huh? That sounds good. But folks, what an excellent morning of fishing on the lake. If you dress for success, you're going to have success. And with the quality of clothing out there now, we can fish all day. So I want to thank Darren Kerrigan and his dad, Larry, for joining me today, as well as Casey Kopp from Montello, Wisconsin. More Midwest Outdoors is right around the corner. I'm Larry Ladowski, and we'll catch you later.